The Formula One circus has arrived in Southeast Asia once more as we usher in a new era and get ready to go racing here in Vietnam. A lap of Hanoi circuit then, 3.4 miles around the Vietnamese capital. A number of the 23 corners take their inspiration from other great circuits, hopefully creating plenty of passing opportunities. It's time to see how our drivers are stacking up after yesterday's exciting qualifying session. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position and Iceman completes the front row. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Bottas, Verstappen, Charles Leclerc and Ricardo, Norris, Albon, Ocon and Sebastian Vettel, Gasly, Kvyat, Sergio Perez and Stroll, Giovinazzi, Latifi, George Russell and Kevin Magnussen, Hubert, a Williams. Which of these talents... Now that we've got some points on the board, let's continue this form and aim for another top 10 finish. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of F1 2020 Career Mode. So today we're at the Vietnam Grand Prix. We didn't do, we didn't do too bad in uh, qualifying actually. Uh, we upped the difficulty for the next couple of races just to see where we are in the pack and see if we need to drop difficulty or if we need to move up a little bit as well. Uh, but we didn't do too bad. Uh, looks like we're going to be doing uh, 7 on soft, 7 on mediums. Uh, so that shouldn't be too bad. Our teammate is a few spots behind us. We beat Vettel. Uh, Hamilton's right there. We're kind of splitting the Mercedes. So, you know, let's uh, without further ado, let's see if we can get another podium here. It's been two races, two first places. So, I think that's when uh, we got to start adjusting the difficulty and see how we're doing. So, let's go ahead and dive right in. All right. So let's see if we can get our tires gripped up here. Nice quick launch. Push Lewis Hamilton out of the way. Lewis just wants to push, push, push me. Oh, ran wide there a little bit. They are definitely faster than me on this track. Give him a little bit of pressure there. Focus now for the rest of the race. Jeez, a bright way too late there. Gee, Lewis is just pulling away. I think I'm gonna power you up. To be within a second, so I can keep get, so I can get the arrest from him.
Yeah, no, he's just pulling away from me. second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. Have to back off there a little bit. Rich Mo, use our ERS. So we can get a little bit closer to him. No point using using rich fuel. We're not gonna be able to catch up to Lewis Hamilton here. He's a little bit too fast for us. Downshift into neutral there by accident. So we lost a lot of time. I feel like our front wing doesn't have enough down force. It's a little bit too light.
Okay, this night, next lap is the pit window, I believe, 7 to 12. Or 7 to 10 is lap, has the pit window. So it's like that with like with the pace of Lewis Hamilton. I'm gonna be second place for most of this race. This has to be podium, but I can't be with his pace. His pace is a little bit too fast. In this lap, in this lap, push now. I'll uh, run rich just so we can get a bit of a gap from Bottas here. Be careful, we think you're going to start losing some tire grip around now. It's a little bit too late, damn it. The nice thing is that Bottas is fighting and fighting Leclerc, Leclerc right, right now. So we have a bit of a leeway. Not too big of a leeway though. Okay, so we're going on to mediums for the rest of the race. Yeah, makes sense. Race kind of cool. Okay, we're still second place, which is good. Stop. Oh, strolls, they're still staying out, eh?
Mine has boxed for the mediums. Go behind on the medium tire. Jeez, this weird corner from over Vietnam, it just can't always get down path fully. Alright, we gotta keep Bottas away here, we got five laps to go. We have five laps of fuel remaining. A little bit late of a break there. I think our brakes are getting a little bit overheated there. Car started sliding there, so I have to really back up the throttle. Bought us caught up to us a little bit from our marm mistakes. Some rich fuel so we can pull away from Bottas here a little bit. Ooh, Lander Norris is out. Wonder what happened to him. Virtual safety car deployed. Slow down and maintain a positive delta. Virtual safety car is deployed. Slow down, slow down. Your delta is negative, which means you are too fast. Reduce your pace. VSC ending, we're going green. Maintain positive delta until the green flags. That safety car really helped Lewis Hamilton there. I couldn't catch up to him because I hate managing my delta. Like, what am I supposed to do? Drive 70, 120, 140? We're not gonna let Bottas buy that easily though. Lando is out of the race. A little bounce off the wall. Also some time there.
We advise moving to mix two, fuel to mix two. to stay with him, he might make a mistake. We could still regain the position. Jesus Christ! Why are you still pushing me, you idiot? Oh my god. Sit tight, the marshals are on their way. Oh, Bottas, Bottas, Bottas. What a race. Jeez, replay. What in the world happened there? Go L2. Okay, let's change the view here. Uh, yeah, let's go this. Jeez, okay, let's rewind back. Cause I think like oh that's far far go back. How far back goes so it goes. So we yeah, we kinda squeezed him, he had nowhere to go, so he hit us. We busted into the wall and then we were right back into him. Jeez, and then he just kept driving. He's like, Yeah, I'm just gonna keep driving against you, man. Like calm down, Bottas. Holy That is just ridiculous. Uh Bottas. Yeah, he lightly got squeezed. He could have been fine, but he... Jeez. And I was like, yeah, let's keep driving. Then what happened to me after? I saw I was like, yeah, I need to reverse out of here. Oh, right there. Took out Leclerc as well, I think. Damn. Oh, that's unfortunate. Retired from that session. Jeez, what a race. Well, McLaren's not going to be happy with us, but I'm going to go talk to Bottas here quickly because he's just cheese. So, another fantastic victory Crazy. for the Silver Arrows. Talk to me, Ants. What was it that set them apart from the competition today? Well, I know it's a bit of a boring answer, but the truth is they simply had the best speed package on the day and a driver who knows how to take advantage of that. It doesn't matter how much time you spend poring over the stats and planning strategies if you can't keep the pace. And our winner today showed they could do both. And I can see the drivers starting to approach the podium for the victory celebration. Oh man. Verstappen and Ricardo. Jeez. Congratulate. We had a decent start actually. We're going hard. We're losing the time against Hamilton so had a couple of mistakes. It's time to see how this result affects the drivers' championship. Our championship leader is still both sat out. at the top of the standings, but their rivals have made up some solid ground today. Now let's discuss how Ants. Who would you say is a contender for driver of the day? There's a few contenders, but George Russell definitely stood out. Did he get a DNF? A really solid drive from him today, and one Weird. I'm sure the fans enjoyed. I know that's at odds with the official decision, but I think they deserve some recognition on a day where both of these drivers are at the top of their game. That's odd. I let's thought move we would have got the a constructors. Mercedes DNF. moved to the top of the table. It was also a strong Grand Prix from Haas F1 this weekend. Fantastic well, work from the American team to move. Well, that is an unfortunate Vietnam race. That's for sure. You know, but we thought we would be doing better. Uh, two to three, so Vettel beat us there, obviously. We're still 18 to 10, so we are winning against the first, first person to 30. Four races remaining. Definitely could have been a better race. Not liking Bottas right now, for sure. We tried really hard in practice and qualifying to get where we were. Made a couple little mistakes, and then pressured bought us a little bit but his retaliation was not was not good for us so 
Hopefully we'll go into the next, uh, oh, I guess into the Chinese Grand Prix, which we're not actually that good at either. <laughs> hopefully we'll, we'll beat him or we'll, uh, we'll make him retire, right? So either way, hope you guys like this episode. Uh, hit the like button below. S- throw me a comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.